Right, this is our new USB controller for our DIY pick and place machine. It replaces the previous seven boards which we'd had for the original version. The new single board unit has two built in power supplies for 12 volts and 5 volts. It has a microchip processor, an Atmel controller, and a second microchip processor. The main processor controls the USB input and it delegates functions to the various outputs including the two LED drivers which are here and here on the board and these control the headlight and the base camera array. There is a MOSFET driver which drives the internal relays for the air supply. The Atmel chip is running Arduino software and that drives one of the stepper drivers for the pick and place actual picker system and along the back edge of the board there are four single stepper drivers which are controlled via the smooth stepper interface and they drive the head motors on the pick and place machine. We added a second pick processor on the board to drive the vibration motor as the main pick processor didn't have enough PWM outputs to drive this and the LED arrays at the same time. The processors all communicate via the I2C bus between the Atmel processor and the microchip processor and also to the secondary microchip processor for the motor. Right, here's a quick overview of the internals of the machine. On the far side we have the smooth stepper interface which comes in via Ethernet from the PC. This, this is driven by Mac3 as the host software. We have our new interface board here which connects to the stepper drivers for the X and Y motors and the X motor on the picker system. We have the main drive motor here for the Y axis. Vacuum control valves here. Uh, the lighting system is controlled via the microprocessor down here and there are two onboard LED drivers. These drive the base LED system which can be varied from the PC by sending USB commands and also the head LED driver system which is located underneath the picker head with a single 3 watt LED and this can be varied in brightness as well from the host PC. This is a test run with the new system with one of our board files. And it also homes at the end. <laughs> 